Well, hello and welcome back. Thanks for coming back. Where are we? To the King's Road. That's where we are, heading out towards Payer. Yes, that was the Princess Vera Resort on our left-hand side. So if your name is Miss Karen, you've got a husband called Mr. Ian, and guess what? A grandson who likes a bit of bubblegum ice cream, and his name's Aaron. That's where you hung out. Time goes, doesn't it? A couple of months ago now, but I know you had a great, great holiday, and I know that Aaron really, really liked his bubblegum ice cream, that's for sure. It was great, great to bump into you, and we look forward to doing it all over again very, very soon indeed. So a big shout out to you all the way up in Scotland. Of course, there's many other people up there in Scotland. Mr. Doug, big, big shout out to you. Of course, my cousin King James, he's got a queen called Queen Kareem, and that means if your dad's a king and your mum's a queen, you must have a little daughter that has to be a princess. And of course, that means that she likes a cupcake or two with a bit of cheesecake flavouring. And her name must be, wait for it, Princess Dali. Good morning to you and hopefully you're having a great, great day all the way up there in Bonnie, Scotland. And hopefully the weather is treating you very, very kind indeed. And we look forward to seeing you very very soon there's an awful lot of people up there in scotland and uh, we like the scottish we really really do and a lot of them seem to like us mr paul so michaela yes we're talking to you all the way in downtown glasgow thanks very much for costing us and thanks very much for being our friends and uh, we look forward to seeing you again next year because of course this year you're not going to come back to cyprus you're actually going to go celebrate your holiday in downtown Turkey in one of the best hotels in the whole of Turkey on a great great occasion which of course will be your wedding anniversary so we look forward to hopefully seeing a video or two or some pictures of that some other superstars on the show who are actually out on a cruise as we speak every day I get some pictures of where they are who are they is what you're asking well Miss Nessie and Mr Andy two of our absolute superstars a little YouTube channel by the way and it's called Nessie and Andy's Travels go and hunt it down and you'll get to see where they're going because they're making videos on their travels in and around the Greek islands and so forth and it wasn't long ago they popped over to Crete on an aeroplane and then when they're not on boats or aeroplanes they are whizzing around in a black beast what's a black beast well you'll have to go and have a look simple as that now let's keep going we are sort of exiting the Tomb of the Kings area We've got the Venus Beach Hotel that was on our left-hand side. We've got the Capital Coast Resort, which is on our left-hand side. We've got an awful lot of manhole covers that are set about one metre too low in the road. This is a bit of a tradition in Cyprus. They go and put a new road in, and uh, because they are, what's the word? Mm, I'll be careful what I say, obviously, but mm, begins with an L to reset the manholes before they do the tarmacking. They then go back and reset the manholes after they've done the tarmacking. And of course, now it makes it very, very difficult to put down the concrete footing to then put the frame for the manhole in. So they just put it on a bit of uh, rubble. So of course, by the next week, the manhole frame and cover has dropped. And now you've got what's even worse than a pothole. There we go, that's the rant over, Mr. Andy. We can all rant all day. In general, I don't like to rant about anything. I take life pretty easy and pretty calm and pretty cool and always dressed head to toe in blue. So, look at that for a sky, by the way. I think it looks pretty nice, doesn't it? There's not a cloud in sight. Oh no, that sky, it's looking blue. You can just about make out of the sea and I'm promising you, well, that's looking very, very blue indeed. Mr. Paul, well, what can I say? He's dressed head to toe in blue. I've even got a brand new t-shirt on. So that means the sky is unbelievably blue. The sea is unbelievably blue. Mr. Paul is unbelievably blue. But, uh, well, not in that way. Well, yes, I am. No, nope, stop it now. So all that's missing is you. Get yourself on a big bird or a canoe and start paddling like crazy. Because I'm telling you, Paphos, Cyprus, Rika and me, we are quite simply 
waiting for you. And we really, really are loving you from the bottom of our two hearts. And we've loved every second of, well, from the start of the YouTube channel to this day. And we know we're going to continue for many, many years to come. I know that upsets one or two people that are watching, but we're not going to stop. My little joke is I'll be 87 sitting in a chair. You never know by then we may even have a production crew and I'll hear some hands clap and I'll jump up and say, well, hello, everybody. How nice to see you. And uh, thanks for coming back. There'll be a crew in the background keeping me going for 12 minutes, 13 minutes. And then I can, of course, collapse back into my chair and uh, go to sleep for, what, another six hours before the next little video is due. We love what we do. We really, really do. And we love meeting you. So if you want to see us, hunt us down in the promenade or in the harbour area you can also bump into us in the most strangest of places we bumped into a couple in a supermarket the other day i was buying a bottle of milk and i don't know what they were buying but they were buying something and uh, we had a bit of a chat it's a fantastic feeling when people make friends that you know would never have met it really really is i think for us and i think for you as well i think it's something perhaps that uh, is slowly becoming part of a Paphos holiday and uh, we hope it continues and we thank each and every person that chooses to watch us. We thank each and every person from the bottom of our hearts that chooses to click through to our about page and uh, hunt us down on the Buy Me Coffee platform and you choose to buy us a virtual coffee. We thank you very, very much for that. We thank the likes of Ian Costa, Miss Tina, all the way out in, uh, I'm trying to think where it is now, is it Surrey, isn't it? Surrey, yeah, all the way out in Surrey that likes to well, help us out by contributing on the YouTube Super Thanks. If you're wondering where the YouTube Super Thanks is, well, with a thumbs up and with a thumbs down, please don't hit that one. Well, you can if you want. I don't mind. Scroll across a bit further. Uh, there's download, there's list load, there's do this, do that, buy your shopping. And then there is a little button with a heart and a little dollar sign in the middle of it. And it says thanks. That's what's called the Super Thanks. Again, you can make a contribution via YouTube to us. So we thank you very much. We really do. You can also come and join us as a superstar with a one off payment every month on the Buy Me Coffee platform as well. So thank you, thank you very much. That's how it works. YouTube doesn't give us a lot, if you understand. Um, you know, you hear all these rumours about millionaire YouTubers. Maybe there are, and, and there are, obviously. But uh, YouTube is the platform that allows them to broadcast, whether it be information, entertainment, boredom, whatever it is. But that's the platform that allows them to get through to you, shall we say. And then it is it up to that YouTuber and up to you on how you are going to generate an income. So we thank you very, very much for putting up with us and for now and again contributing to us. So thank you very much. We're in downtown Kasonaga, that's where we are. We are saddling the coastline. This is the coast road from Paphos to Paya and beyond. You, you can keep going and uh, go into the Akamas off-roading and uh, you can keep going and circle way round to Polis. But uh, I wouldn't advise you to do it in a higher car. I have done it, not in a higher car, but I've actually done it in a Mercedes E-Class. And you're thinking, what? Yeah, I did. Because I'm one of those people who's a little bit stupid, as you may have noticed. There we go. Downtown Kisonega, if you're staying in this area, well, the shops everywhere. You can even bring your cat or your dog, because there's the house of paws. So he can be, well, poor, doesn't it? And all tarted up and made to look very, very nice. If you want some pool cleaning chemicals, there's Florida pools. And if you want your computer fixed while you're here, there's Paphos computers. Or if you want to pop in and get a can of Coke, there's a kiosk especially for you. And look at those beautiful, spectacular red umbrellas with those two magic words, Coca-Cola. None of that Pepsi rubbish in there. I'm still hunting that Pepsi rep. And when I find him, well, he's in trouble, that's for sure. I'm going to tie him up, chuck him in the boot, and take him out into the uh, canvas. Now you understand the last time when I went out into the canvas in the Mercedes, yes, I had something in the boot. And when I came back, I was that little bit lighter.
Anyway, let's keep going. Very, very shortly, you're going to get a spectacular view out across the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. And on top of that, we're going to go past one of the most popular beach bars in the whole of Cyprus. Never mind just Paphos. It's called the CU Beach Bar. And you literally sit on the cusp of the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. The views are to die for. It's a spectacularity of a view. And there's an awful lot of chops in, us in the water because it's actually what they call a riptide area. Now, people do go swimming in there, but I say to you now, please, please, and I mean please, please, just paddle. Don't go out too far because we understand if a riptide catches you, one, it can take you down or it can take you out. And that's not going to be a very good ending to your whole day. Although, of course, you won't know much about it. Coming up is the Bayside Kiosk. One of the greatest kiosks in downtown Paphos, open 24 hours a day. So if the boys in blue are chasing you when you've been out on a job at night, that could be the place for you. But be warned now, more often than not, they pop in there too. So perhaps not the best place to stop. See you Beach Bar, there it is on the left hand side. By the car park there, there are signs explaining about the riptides. Of course, most people don't read them. They just go into the bar and have a drink and then go into the sea. It's a great, great place. I'm not trying to scare you. That's not what I'm trying to do. But please, please be very careful. There is a lifeguard on duty pretty much all day. And uh, they also have a jet ski as well. So, you know, if you do get into trouble, they'll come out and get you. Hopefully. Well, if they're not drinking a frappe or the mobile phone. No. They are very, very good. And they do take their jobs very, very seriously indeed. As do all lifeguards around the world. They are very, very alert people. So, Next time, come back for the Baywatch Paphos edition. We'll get Gracibia Le Bouffe to put on an all-in-one red suit. And to be honest, well, Pamela Anderson has not got what it takes compared to watching Gracibia Le Bouffe, that's for sure. I mean, she's going to just steal your balls straight away. Isn't that right, Lord Richie? No girl and no man is safe when Miss watching Gracibia Le Bouffe is about well they're quite safe it's your money in your wallets and your purse that's what you've got to worry about spectacular view of the blue 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 mediterranean sea ali i'm pretty sure you know that that's payer mr neil don't choke yet well you may have choked on the balls i don't know anyway shut up now boy. that is downtown payer i'm going to say to you thanks for watching and of course if you do like what you see want to hit that like click that subscribe perhaps come back for a little bit more of my complete and utter lunacy. Coral Bay is on the left hand side. That's where a lot of people go when they come to the Payer area for a holiday. And of course, a lot of people rent villas and apartments in Payer itself. If you want to know where one of those hotels is or where one of those villas is or one of those apartments is, you drop it in the comments and we'll go and hunt it down for you. All you have to do, well, it's very simple, a coffee or two. Thanks for watching. And of course, we will see you again very, very soon indeed. There's the big sign. Welcome to Payer Municipality. Thanks for watching.